When we convert units, we typically make use of conversion factors. So it's helpful to know some of these. A lot of these you probably already know just from general use. For example, one foot is 12 inches. But this is a conversion factor. This is useful for converting from feet to inches. One yard you probably know is three feet. And that's also the same thing as 36 inches. So you could say that one yard is three feet. You could say one yard is 36 inches. Or you could say three feet is 36 inches. All of those would be true statements. One mile. One mile is 5,280 feet. Also, one mile is 1,609 meters. So if you run track or something, the 1,600 meter race isn't quite one mile. You really need that extra nine meters to make it a full mile. One inch is 2.54 centimeters. And one meter, I'm going to say, is 3.28 feet. So one meter is a little over three feet. One meter is a little bit bigger than one yard. One kilometer is 1,000 meters. And that K, kila, means literally 1,000. So when you read one kilometer, think 1,000 meters. That's what a kilometer is, 1,000 meters. One minute, you know, of course, is 60 seconds. One hour is 60 minutes and that's equal to 3600 seconds and one day you know is 24 hours and that equals 1440 minutes which equals 86,400 seconds so one day is 86,400 seconds now if you know these conversion factors, and you don't have to know these, you can look them up. If you know them or know where to look them up, then you can convert units. Convert from miles to meters or from days to seconds, whatever you need to do. And since we're dealing here with lengths and times, these will also be useful in converting speeds from one unit to another.